Right, welcome to Seoul. It's a lot warmer. I'm in a t-shirt. It's lovely. Can't stay here long. The destination is still China. I'm trying to get to Shanghai. I don't know if you remember Wu Ming, who's the Tai Chi instructor who teaches there. She said that we could do some Tai Chi, so that could be fun. I'll wait in Shanghai until it's safe to go to Hubei. So I'm going to the ferry terminal to check if the ferry is getting quarantined. Qingdao or uh, Yuan, nothing. E everything cancelled. They could easily put a sign on their website saying we're not actually running, but no. Off to the airport. So yeah, my goal to not fly isn't going very well. But again, it's my own fault for traveling during an epidemic. We've been waiting in Shanghai airport for about two hours now. We'll get there eventually. This is Wu Ming's Tai Chi studio. So talking about the earth being really big, we're in the supermarket and look at this fruit. You don't get that in England. Look at this. It's so beautiful. Bright colours. So in the same way that the Chinese language evolved completely separately from the English language, you have completely separate fruit families that you cannot find on the other side of the planet. I like that. Mum, you'll like this tree. This tree is called the Shanghai flower tree. And look, it's a whole tree exclusively of flowers. There's no leaves on it. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> 